Baker's Holt hit numerous record highs and even the highest record low in March. It was a dry month for what's been a dry year. 23 ABC's Kelly Johnson is live tonight and tells us why Governor Jerry Brown took action to fight the heat. Kelly. Well, Grace, yeah, it hasn't been done before, but today Governor Brown issued for mandatory statewide water reductions. I hit Mill Creek Park earlier today to ask residents what they do to save water, but soon these choices may no longer be just an option. Catching up with residents at Mill Creek Park, they say they are doing their best to save water. Take shorter showers, I guess. One thing that I do is um, when I brush my teeth, I'll, you know, turn the water off. This downtown Bakersfield neighborhood shows that spring is in full bloom. But come summertime, the neighborhood may have a completely different look if Governor Brown has his way. That's kind of bad because I don't want my grass looking bad because it kind of gives off a bad impression. The idea of your nice little green grass getting lots of water every day, uh, that's going to be a thing of the past. It's dry in Bakersfield and the snow has completely melted in the mountains. This time lots of Yosemite shows images of the National Park taken on March 19th over a period of four years, spanning from 2011 to 2015. This is the first year in its uh, measurements going back to 1942 where this snow course has been bare, no snow at all. Seeing Echo Summit was a major eye-opener for Governor Brown and like Yosemite. As you can clearly see, there is no snow at this location. No snow and very little rain. Not only did March bring record highs, but it remained dry with a cumulative rainfall total of just over two-tenths of an inch, making yearly rainfall totals over an inch and a half behind. Residents will have to become more accountable to restrict water usage. I do take shorter showers. I uh, turn off the water when I brush my teeth. Like I wash my dishes by hand and stuff. Soon these choices may no longer be optional. Today, Governor Brown called on the Water Resources Control Board to implement mandatory water restrictions with the goal of reducing water usage by 25 percent. Turning off that faucet a little quicker, getting out of the shower a little faster, and not flushing the toilet every time. Now, those are just some of Governor Brown's tips, but soon he'll have more plans in place, including replacing lawns with more drought-tolerant landscaping. Back to you, Tim. Kelly Johnson.